there we go. Yeah. The dealership must have changed your oil last time. That thing's all there tight. Ooh, boy. Grab this off the old mom. Coming in hot, it's huh? Mad. Ooh. Oh, man. Snug it out, huh? I don't know. I don't need to close it up. That's pretty good. Huh. Hey, guys. Just stole uh, your mom's Honda yeah. Shadow, eh? All right. Are you out of the mine? So, uh, 17, draining the oil. Yeah. Working on the detail. Honda Shadow, 2011 Honda Shadow, 750 Aero. Yep. Just a little tutorial changing oil. Stole it from his mom. Yeah, or just... went and kiped it out of her garage. Rode it over here fast as heck. Didn't break no laws. You know, no laws. Ran over there, grabbed it off of her. Gonna do a little fixing up, a little maintenance, and a little clean on her today. Had to get there without her getting on me. So, I think we're good, though. I don't, she don't know where, where this little shop is. So, we'll get it all done up for her. Surprise her with it. So, we got some cleaning supplies, some oil. Oil filter? Yeah, oil, oil filter. All like the leather conditioners and stuff. We're gonna get all those on there for her. A little Wix filter, that's all they had over there at the freaking O'Reilly's today. So first things first, gonna uh, drain the oil. Alright. Yep. Ain't no BMW ain't got no work stand on it, you know? Yeah, you got spoiled with them BMWs. Yeah. So what year is this thing? I mean, this one's a 2011 750 Aero. It's a pretty clean bike. Uh, got like, let's see, 14,000 on it. A little much, but it's really clean. Old guy before. All right, 17. So, uh, would you say this is a beginner or an expert bike? I'd say it's definitely like 12 year old boy to 50 year old woman's bike. <laughs> you know, there's a big range there, but beginner, beginner so, bike. You know. Sorry, all you Honda Shadow lovers. But I would if she, they're cheap. They're cheap, easy cruisers, but she wants a different bike. But I don't know if she'll end up getting one or not. Yeah, this is a 50 year old woman's bike right here. So. I gotta go grab the other tools out of my car. I bet you do. So, uh, what's five things you like about the bike? Five things you hate about the bike. Uh, I think I'd have to maybe start off with eight, and then it might make me appreciate some other things. I don't think I got five things I like. So, uh, it's nimble. It's light and nimble. That's a positive. Yeah, it is. It is really light, actually. It's a decent bike if you if that if you're just cruising around town. Good bike. Great bike. There's a plus for it. If you ever want to get on a highway, I think it overspins and just a dog. It doesn't do good. But it is a good bike to start on. I keep trying to tell her that she needs to just get a, a newer Honda, like 1100. She wants another Honda. I don't know if the Hondas are... No gold wings. His favorite, but... Yeah. Gold wings are heavy. They're cool cruisers, but man, they're heavy. Yeah, I, it's a lot of bike to I keep standing up. She's strong, but I don't know if uh, she's keeping up a gold one. <laughs> this thing was just a little dusty. Honda Shadow, you know any history behind the? Is this like uh, the same Honda that does mowers? <laughs> 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 or is it like the same Honda that does Honda Civics? Uh, I don't know of any of uh, any Civics with a V twin though. No, there ain't nothing like that. They're all Don't got no motorcycle lift here. It is all at right. the other shop. So what size is the uh, drain plug? 17er. She's a 17er, eh? Yeah. Open end, work a little better. Is that what you grabbed? I think I'm going to have to use the open end. Just so, well, I have my little ratchet girl on her. Oh, you got the little ratchet. I thought you grabbed an open end. Jeez. There we go. Yep. The dealership must have changed your oil last time. That thing's all there tight. They probably use some of that Loctite red. Yeah. Blue. It, it kind of felt like it, honestly. It kind How's of that oil like looking down there? Get it's about to come out in a second. Oh, you ain't done yet. Did not put my gloves on first. Oh, yeah, you had to put the gloves. Oh, uh, all sweaty hands. 
Yeah, well, those looking pretty good though. Those look pretty nice. Yeah. Look pretty nice out here. It's a good it's a good lay down on the ground. Hot days, cold concrete. Broken. Drained the oil now, I figured get it out of there after the ride, everything was circulating, everything was broke down in there, so we're all good on that. Yeah. Crack the filter open and throw the new filter on, fill it back up. So Where's the filter at? Got it over here. If you need a filter, O'Reilly's, they usually have these Wix ones. The Wix ones, uh, WL 10,000. Decent filter. I do recommend maybe getting the factory Honda stuff, eBay and uh, Amazon have a, the three quart kit with filter and all that and a nice little funnel to help you fill it. So, and it's fairly cheap, just about the same price as this, but you got to wait on it. Three things I like about the bike, I would say, um, the seats are comfortable, the stock ones, they're pretty decent. They got a lot of cushion in them, so I do like that. Uh, another thing I do like about it is how easy the clutches are on them. I'm used to the race bikes, street bikes, some Harleys. This one's just easy to ride. You hop on it, you go. Nothing's going to break on you or let you down, so that's always pretty cheap. Oh, yeah. Cheap, cheap, cheap. You fill it up. Even now, gas being high, you go to the right gas station, you fill up for cheap. You ride it for a week before you ever have to think about gas. Let's put this drain bowl back in. Oh, she's still seeping. It's like clean oil, dude. I'm going to put that in the floor today. Oh, you are? Oh, yeah, I should have used the clean pan. Dude, that's brand new oil. Well, we've drained the new oil out the bike, man. Dang, right? What are you doing over here, buddy? Oh, I gotta grab this old filter down here. Grab it then. Grab and twist. Yeah, I need a glove. You grab me one of, one of them old technician gloves over there. There we go. Uh, oh, yeah. These are rag close. Yeah. If you spray it with brake clean, uh, it makes the paint thin out and makes it real sticky, and then you get extra grip. Yeah, we just don't have none right now. I, did, yeah. I forgot. Yeah. Did you eat your Wheaties? Yeah, I'm just cleaning it off, right. wiping it, use a different part of the rag, get better grip. Yeah, I mean, I've dented them with my bare hands before. Oh, yeah, me too. Did someone put that on with a tool? <laughs> it's a Honda. Freak. It's from the dealer, man. Just put a little oil on the ring, hand tighten. Did you give me a little piper? Yeah, dude, that's the best way. The pie's piper? Yeah, yeah. when you uh, do home construction and mechanics, Mechanics, you learn that tools have multiple uses. You just gotta know how to use them. There you go. Did it slip or did it? Oh yeah, get a butt with your hand now. Shoot. Shoot. I just want to make sure so I didn't have to lift it back in there. Yep. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Pipe wrench to save the day. Thank you. Yeah. I didn't think to go grab my uh, filter wrenches. I didn't think I'd need it. Got the fancy Samson like. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a cool shot with all the cars in the back. Beautiful. Got the jack stands, skateboard. Skateboard. The live stream. You ball Yeah, we're gonna try and podcast for you guys coming up. We're gonna choose a car, talk a topic, tell you all about it. All right, we ready to fire this thing up? No, I got to fill her with oil. Oh. <laughs> oh. Right, Josh. oh. oh man. We're trying to listen to Rattle. Always lube your O-rings. I don't care if it's filters, injectors. You know what I mean? Just lube it. I mean, you <laughs> you spit on my oil filter, boy. I'm a whoop that butt. I do. Honda. All right. Third thing I like. Pan up to me. Third thing I like how easy it is to actually change the oil on these compared to some of the other bikes I've had. This thing is the easiest to change the oil on. Easiest. You heard Filter it here. right off bottom. You don't have to take off no covers, no nothing. Right under the bottom, drain pans on the front, oil, pan, oil filters on the back. You heard so it. Easy. You heard it at bald tire first. Always run. I, I run them before I change oil on a bike. I like to let the engine run at least until I can feel some heat getting in the pipes. And then shut it off, let it sit for a good minute, two, three, start draining, get your filter off. So you tilt that thing up for me a little bit so I can easily get the bolt back. Oh boy. I tilted <laughs> up a little too easy. <laughs> yeah. 
It is light and nimble, man. We did say that in the review. Yeah. Oh, man. I'm ready to ride this thing. I don't know about that. How long till she knocks, you think? Ah! Are you at least going to do a burnout? For yeah, it's a brand new tire. Oh. Organic, non pesticide, non herbicide, non GMO, locally homegrown. Is there uh, seats Whoa. in the center like a church? Yeah. 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 That's live stream. Oh, you guys are live? No pesticides, homegrown. All right. All right. Oh. Yeah, that's so sweet. I like it, and they mm. get and they get sweeter too. Thank you, man. Yeah, you will. Hey girls, a little bald tire special. Hunter Shadow Seven Fifty Arrow Burnout. You had to break in the oil change. Yeah, had to give it a little break in. A yeah, little we'll break in on the oil change. You can see where the tread stuck if you're opening the truck. <laughs> like, comment, thanks for watching. Enjoy some of these rollers. Thank you.